Hey, what are you doing over there? <laughs> I'm freezing. <laughs> <laughs> hey, code. Hey, pumice. Hey, viewers. I always imagine you up there in the skies. <laughs> yeah, it's time for another Minecraft Realms. Docs Realms is back. This is the fourth generation. And yeah, once again, me and my buddies of the Sipcrowd server picked an epic seed. This one also contains all yeah, the main or all the important biomes you might want to look for. We used um, Code Raider Seed Finder for that. Thanks a lot again, buddy. And yeah, we have this little ice cave here that is this time the startup. Here it is, uh, the chest with the law and this time we're gonna give Doc Slicer to the first person logging on. Um, sharpness 5, Unbreaking 3, Fire Aspect 2, Looting 3 sword. so that'll help you in the beginning quite a bit to get some food going. And yeah, for all of the guys watching the first time, what is Doc's Realms? Well, we basically invite five random people that uh, apply in the comments of these Realms videos with their building ideas and they play here for a week and yeah, try to accomplish uh, what they want to, their plans, their ideas and yeah, even more sometimes. Um, the last two generations and also the first generation was pretty crazy, setting the bar high and it gets difficult. Um, for new generations to impress people, I fear. But yeah, we always said it's mostly about having fun and enjoying yourself. And can't wait what people will make out of this. Your spawn will be over here. And then you see this huge mountain, just go towards it and you will find the ice cave with dog slicer. And yeah, it should be a bit of a safe spot here. You have a personal bodyguard. <laughs> oh, does he have a name? We should give him a name, Thomas. <laughs> yeah. That would actually be funny. How about little pommes? <laughs> little, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, I'm not sure little is the right term, but... <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> um, while pommes is making the name tag, we'll figure out a good name. Uh, I'll go through my list. We, yeah, it took us another two hours or so to read that all, uh, but I think we came up with five good builds. Keep on applying. I, it's so hard, man. Like, we just talked about it, pommes and I. You see so many comments of people saying, man, I'm applying the third time now. I don't know if you even read that. I swear, we read them all. We consider them all, but yeah, we always try to mix it up a bit. And, you know, it doesn't matter. You know, you can post your same application over and over. Um, it doesn't matter. It's not spam for me. Uh, just, you know, um, we really try. But at the moment, we can only let five people on. But yeah, I have some plans for the next year but yeah we talk about that at a given time so now without further ado let's let lose some players here on this new epic seat and yeah let's pick or let's name the new five players for generation four okay guys and here we are time to pick the next generation it was hard as mentioned and yeah gonna add the first guy i have him copied in here Dominixer. Dominixer, he basically uh, wants to give the nether some love. I like that. He said, man, yeah, like the nether never gets love and he wants to go there, build a hardcore base in there, make it really safe. He basically said he wants to make it childproof. <laughs> so, yeah, have a nice base there to live uh, in the middle of a lava lake. And yeah, just make it homely. And yeah, I'm excited to see that. It's going to be a tricky project. Have fun with the guests. <laughs> uh, but yeah, <laughs> your choice. I'm excited to see what you can do. So number one, Dominix, so welcome to the realms. And yeah, let's pick the next guy. He's 21 year um, from... Did he say where he was from? No, but I liked his idea. He wants to make um, Ender Dragon Castle with a parkour game inside. So, of course, that would be made in the end. And, yeah, it would um, include killing the, the dragon because if it is there, it is a problem. And, yeah, it would be a cool parkour style build. And as I am super bad in parkour and I never play it, I would love to try it out. And, yeah, hopefully he gives us a fair challenge, which is not too hard. And his IGN is TU... Uh, C I N to C Nikes. I hope I have pronounced it correctly. To C Nikes. Yet yeah, that's correct. Invite the guy. Let's see if he is existing. Yes, he is. Awesome. Sweet. We have two. 
three more to go. I'm excited what this generation can do, really. it's, it's So far, it's been a blast. Alright, so, the next guy is Prisoner. Prisoner 100 and... Um, prisoner... Prisoner, yeah, 108. Let's invite the guy and let's uh, talk about his project. He's from England, 15 years old. Um, and he would like to do an underground mining village with uh, functional auto semi auto farms, animal farms, and um, housing integrated into the ravines. And <laughs> luck called it, but right next to the mountain, there is actually an epic ravine on the seed. So maybe he could try to use that ravine for that. It was pure coincidence. But yeah, that's good. So yeah, and he would build that and you have several la layers and levels, walkways everywhere. And I personally always wanted to do a, a ravine build, really make it look cool. And I'm excited what the guy can do there. And yeah, so we shall see. Three guys. Number four, number four. Um, let's see, what was that? Oh yeah, that sounded, um, of course, pretty crazy his name is maybe program sacred redstone and it was a very good suggestion it was uh, upvoted also by a bunch of people and he wants to do something that may sound familiar to some people who watch sespling he once made this redstone game ah, what was the name of it do you remember it still guys I have no idea, I'm sorry. Yeah, it was a redstone puzzle <laughs> map, yeah. basically. Um, oh, that's what yeah. um, what Sacred Redstone wants to do. Um, you basically get a certain amount of redstone pieces at the beginning, and then there is an increasing, yeah, with increasing difficulty, redstone puzzles, and you basically have to go from room to room and unlock um, the next room. So that should be super cool um, and hopefully interesting. And yeah, now I have to... Um, Skip down a bit and uh, pick the last guy um, on my document here, so be right back. Alright, and here we are with the last guy, and this time it is... Volcano... Oh, wait, miss. Volcano... And 223. And his name is actually Program. He wants to make this huge volcano. And, you know, functional volcano, lava flowing and stuff, and uh, make the environment um, accordingly, of course, you know, barren land and destruction and um, also a village uh, with possibility to trade there. So, yeah, that also sounds really interesting. And I'm jumping back on the server here. Let's see, what's his name now, Pommes? Cody. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> I got inspired by someone. <laughs> okay. I wonder why. <laughs> so come and join Cody here on the realms. <laughs> um, we picked fa five guys now and yeah, I'll keep on doing this. I'm enjoying it a lot. Guys, keep on applying. We what we do is like this it depends, you know, what the what the generation does. Like uh, last generation had so much stuff built and uh, that I decided to split it up in several episodes. It was actually three or four episodes with all these builds the guys did. Um, we, re we were reading the comments on all these episodes, so you can apply on any Realms episode, but it we cannot go back to Generation 2 now or so. So, <laughs> yeah, please uh, keep on commenting and um, for the next generation we will consider any application that comes um, yeah, starting from this video. Alright, so that's the plan with that and yeah, just throw down a comment and we want to remind you one more time guys, don't forget your IGN. <laughs> yeah, so many people we would have chosen. Yeah, they didn't post the IGN. Like in, we we in literally the had uh. five or six amazing ideas uh, where people just didn't post their IGN, and I cannot assume that the YouTube name is the same. So please, <laughs> don't forget about that. And yeah, that's it. Looking forward to your builds, guys, and please keep applying. Um, I'll try my best to, to give all of you a chance if I can. And yeah, as mentioned, for next year we're gonna take it to the next level. But I'll tell you about that very soon. Thanks again for Pommes, who always helps me, you know, making these little creative builds. We just meet up and go like, okay, let's, let's make a cave this time. Boom. Done. <laughs> and code. <who laughs> this one was actually me. a lot quicker. Than that. Yeah, oh. some of the other builds took longer, that's true. And yeah, and code, who always helps me picking the seeds. Thanks a lot for that too. And yeah, guys, looking forward to what these guys can do on here. Oh yeah, I'm excited. I hope you too. We are out. See you soon with some updates here from the realms. I'm out. Bye. Bye. Bye.